Both doctors and patients alike are bonding over the philosophy of integrative medicine and its whole body approach of not only treating the disease, but treating the patient as well. This past May, the Peter Brody Lung Cancer Center officially opened its doors as part of the Siegel Cancer Center at the Jewish General Hospital. An official opening ceremony was held to celebrate this unique center, which offers both Western and other complementary medicines in a completely integrated manner. Personalized medicine means we try and not only deal with the physical needs, but we deal with the spiritual needs. And that is truly, I believe, what is encompassed in this extraordinary center. We are the only lung cancer specific center in Canada. Our center offers both a fully integrated and interdisciplinary program, which includes, amongst others, um, the medical team, pulmonary oncologists, thoracic surgeons, palliative care specialists, radiation oncologists, and a pathologist. In addition, we offer complementary services, which is supplied by a dietitian, physiotherapist, acupuncturist, massage therapist, and traditional Chinese medicine doctor. I have very much at the front of my mind uh, uh, a man that I only spoke to once over the phone, but Peter uh, and everything I've read about him uh, confirms uh, what I've been told about him was a remarkable person who uh, who was uh, a person who stood for innovation and I think would have been uh, really thrilled at the power of uh, what we're trying to do and what we will do. Peter Broidy was firstly a scientist. It would be important to him that any advances that were to be made towards bettering the lives of cancer patients were to be done within the context of scientific research. And there is no one place that promotes and applies the scientific method more rigorously than a hospital. While certain services of the Broidy Center have long been available to patients through the Pulmonary Oncology Department of the GGH, this new state-of-the-art facility provides a permanent home for the Pulmonary Oncology Program's dedicated and multidisciplinary team of healthcare experts. Because we do uh, outcome measurements as well uh, for a patient that we see here, and, uh, and, and we did do a, a pilot study, so um, the results was very positive. Um, most of the time the patient reported that they feel calmer, more relaxed, uh, especially the pain is um, uh, relieved. And I've been a massage therapist for nearly 20 years and um, certainly in the last five years I've noticed, um, five to ten years I've noticed an, a significant increase it's not that Western medicine is, is, has become not the answer to all, it is still, and they're making increasingly excellent research and progress in the Western side of things. But what's happening is they're realizing there's, there's still a hole in the treatments. We still need these. This, this helps make the hole. Overlooking St. Joseph's Oratory amidst a beautiful backdrop, the Peter Broidy Center was designed to instill patients with a sense of peace and tranquility. The idea was to get away from the typical hospital setting, uh, introduce a lot of natural light, uh, gardens, something that would not make you think of a typical hospital setting it was the jumping off point for the, for the project. Jonathan Suss and Natalie Ohayon are the project managers assigned to the center. There's, there's definitely a sort of feng shui, um, calm um, vision to the project, which I recognize right away. Uh, a lot of green, a lot of uh, glass to let through natural light. Um, our main goal is really uh, not to look like a hospital, to look more, uh, more calming for patients. Patients have sometimes benefited from the combination of Western and traditional medicine. However, treatment has never been offered by a hospital team of conventional and complementary practitioners treating the entire patient. In China, they practice Western and Eastern medicine naturally. They understand when, it, when um, using Western medicine is more effective than just uh, Eastern, but what they tend to do is use both. And, um, and there is a kind of understanding uh, philosophically of where each comes uh, and how to complement one another. And I think that's what we have learned here. We look at Eastern uh, philosophies of practice as the, maybe the holistic part 
of caring for the whole patient, the, the rationale for caring for the whole patient. And the Western, which, I mean, I'm simplifying it because, of course, we have psychology and we are caring and try to nurture patients, but the reality is that we tend to filter everything around the illness. And uh, so actually, it is a nice uh, um, complementary uh, approach. And I don't think it was that difficult to come around. If you would like more information on the Peter Brady Lung Cancer Center, please call 514-340-8225. For JGH TV, this is Astrid Murray. In. Start with it small and small. <laughs> yeah.